Hey everybody, Dan here with Pain For You. Today's topic is gonna be, don't fix the old roads, build new ones. So I'll tell you in a minute what I'm talking about with that. So, breathe a little bit. Breathe in the peace, exhale the stress. Breathe in the bravery. Exhale the fear. Breathe in the calm. Exhale all the anxiety. So what the heck am I talking about? Don't fix the old roads. Build new ones. I'm talking about the brain, neuroplasticity, how this brain works. Right? There's a lot of talk in the TMS mind-body neural circuit community about this thing called neuroplasticity. There's a big belief that says, wow, these neural pathways must be really worn and grooved, and therefore it's going to take a really long time to disconnect them. And so I'm learning a little bit deeper about this concept called neuroplasticity and how the brain works and how it can create new connections very quickly. So instead of spending, you know, years trying to fix or disconnect these old, worn neural pathways, these habitual pathways, I'm going to say build a new one. So what I mean is, instead of worrying about fixing the old crap, build a bypass. Let's just go around it. So what the hell does that look like? <laughs> what I'm suggesting is we've got these neural pathways that have learned to stay firing and so when we try to fix them we're actually utilizing them we're staring at them we're trying to unwire or disconnect or cut them and all that does is keep us focused on the thing that we don't want which is going to keep those neural pathways being used and those connections firing and so a lot of what I try to get across here is teaching your brain that we're really safe. We are safe in the moment. We're safe in our emotions. We're safe in our physical body. We're safe in our thinking. There's several concepts that I go over over and over again which will help convince the brain of that. But a lot of what we want to do in creating these new pathways is give the brain an alternative place to go instead of down the old worn worn out road and so if you had the choice of a brand new you know super highway that bypasses the busy downtown downtown pot pothole filled roads um, I would take the brand new freshly paved super highway that goes around town right and so I kind of view the old worn neural pathways of, of chronic pain and symptoms as the, the slow, busy, bumpy road through town. And what I'm suggesting here is that with consistent messages of safety, and there's that phrase again, consistent messages of safety, we can create that bypass that goes around the old neural pathways and create brand new ones that talk about peace, joy, happiness, productivity, a focus on the things we want, learning to play more, enjoy ourselves more, laugh more. That'll create this new, better road called happiness and contentment so that as your brain comes up to the juncture and uh, it needs to make a decision. Instead of worrying about waiting until that old road is fixed, the brain can simply say, listen to that, is that a hawk? I think it's a hawk. Instead of deciding to go down that old, bumpy, worn, painful road, the brain can make a new decision in the moment to take the new, happy, pain-free, safe road that um, is much more pleasurable to drive down. And so don't fix the old road. 
let's build a new one. And this way, the, the entire concept of, well, I've got all these old, well-worn neural pathways, it's going to take forever to fix them. It's not. We can change our thoughts in an instant. The brain can shift directions in an instant. If you're walking around looking at plants and flowers and squirrels, and all of a sudden there's a brain there, your brain can make a decision immediately. To, uh, if there's a bear there, your brain can make a decision immediately to say, brain's the focus. And so the brain can think and change in a fraction of a second. Think about blue, think about yellow, think about red. Your brain just jumped from each of these things. So when we continually work to create this safe highway, this safe neural pathway that says, I'm pain free, I'm good, I'm comfortable, I'm laughing, I'm joyous, right? The brain can create these new neural pathways for this new way of living a heck of a lot faster than if you say, I've got to go in with the bulldozers and the, and the construction machinery and fix the old roads. I don't think there's anything to fix here. I don't think we need to heal our brain. I don't think we need to heal our bodies. I don't think we need to fix our thinking. Uh, we don't have to take it so seriously. Um, we don't have to fix our emotions. We just have to have more safety messages than danger messages so that the overwhelming evidence is that we're safe. And when we do that, I think the brain will automatically take care of creating this new roadway or this new neural pathway called comfort. The pain and the symptoms can let go. They can disconnect. And that's why I think it happens pretty quickly for some people. Because they quickly realize I'm not in danger. And the fear drops from way up here to way down low. And when the fear drops, we're able to shift our attention to what we want not what we don't want. And when you take away fear and attention, which in my opinion are two of the main fuel sources for chronic pain, it can let go pretty quickly because you are at that point establishing a new pathway that says I'm safe, I'm good, I'm happy, I'm having fun, I'm focused on the things I want. And the brain disconnects over here and reconnects over there. And with consistency, the safety becomes a new default. So I believe that's what it takes. Don't worry about fixing the old roads or disconnecting anything. Just focus on what you want. Focus on the fact that you are truly safe in the moment and you will be in the future. And keep your eyes on that road because if you don't keep your eyes on that road, you might miss the exit and stay on the bumpy road the painful one, the one that goes really slow through the middle of the city. You don't want to get stuck in that traffic jam. So, don't take take the old, old road. Don't fix the old road. Know that you can create a new safety, a new, a new road called uh, Safety Highway. And uh, consistency of thought, consistent messages of safety, a focus on what you want, Smile more, laugh more, more joy. Play more. Do things that are fun more. The brain will figure it out. The brain knows what to do. So what do you guys think? Are you stuck trying to fix the old roads? I think the more we focus on building a new one, by focusing on what we want, the faster that new road will be built, and the quicker the brain will take that new road. So... Love you guys and gals. <coughs> Excuse me. Love you guys and gals. And with that sneeze, I'm going to sign off. See you tomorrow.